Guys, I have a very big announcement that I could not make before we could I have one guys. I am your next Miss Candidation Universe and I'm so excited guys. Now we're gonna Can take we pictures. Talk about this account? It doesn't even fit in the camera frame. I'll know. see you guys later. Bye. Oh my god, we're in the hey guys! It is your guys' Miss Junior Teen Candidation Universe! Tell I me mean, who doubted her. Come on, it's good. I her. doubted myself when we went on stage when they were announcing that like the runner ups. I was like, what if I'm a runner up? Like I will <laughs> cry. But no. I, she won. No, 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 you a Miss Canda. I'm a Miss Canda, guys. How did you feel, Gunnar, when you were on stage and they were about to announce? So, the for like the little miss, that was the first category. That was the scariest part for me because I'm like crap we're the next one and when they're like okay the running up is this i'm like okay at least my name didn't go there when they were about to say the winner they kept like tricking us saying other names and i felt like crying like just announced the winner already i'm scared but when they announced my name i was crying so much almost i was like oh my god like i couldn't believe it and now you uh, next step the um, do um Miss uh, Competition Miss Nation and, uh, Universe. Miss Nation. So, as soon as I got out of one pageant, I am on to the next one for Miss Nation Universe, which is happening this November. The so, Miss Florida. Miss now, Florida. And, no, Miss Nation Universe, it's happening in Florida. But the, so, yeah, that's in the Florida. Stay yeah. tuned for that, guys, because there's going to be a lot of exclusive updates now, again, for that. And yeah, uh, Ashu, how was your reaction? Um, When I was sitting in the crowd, I remember, because Benora, I know, like, she was awesome and she, like, prepared so mm -hmm. much and, like, the she. Old audience or judges everybody yeah come really, in the group shock the oh people, my god the, the people in the pageant told us i'm not gonna accept this here i'm tired of holding the camera today guys the people in the what's it called i don't think you can do it yeah i don't think okay fine i'll hold it the people in the um judges and like all those like crew members and the boss um who uh, work who gives work to Nora and stuff all those people were telling the directors like Gnor Lily broke the score because every girl was like scored and she broke the score her score was a hundred plus and literally guys I'm not even like being over dramatic like we literally like were like the whole room was sh like shook when Gnor started speaking it was echoing because everyone else like all the girls did really good no doubt but all the other girls voice was really low you know when your voice is low like even mine and my my voice is very like just low in general no, when she spoke the, the, the other girl the little bit maybe uh nervous the, uh, nervous the yeah. so maybe they know proper yeah. uh, but when uh, Gnur, the is the gnur yeah. and, uh, i did so much preparing thank you for the gnur yeah. the pageant yeah. teacher coach, yeah. yes i want to give such a big shout out to you yeah. 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 thank you to her thank you so much she's gonna be so happy she's gonna be very happy but yeah when Gnur spoke in the mic and introduced herself or even when she answer the question yeah, it felt yeah, like the world like it was just it was it like i think it was obvious you know it was one of those things yeah. you just know and yeah but like when i was sitting there i was definitely nervous not because that gunner is not gonna win or i don't like believe in her it was more of a thing that i was scared like what if she trips or what if she gets nervous or you know those what ifs i think get you more scared i than know nervous. for sure yeah, but I a, lot of a lot of girls yeah were i literally so, did the best yeah. it was a very yeah, fun event no 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 yeah anyways so, we'll uh, see you guys later we will and i'm sorry the vlog is all over the place so i don't feel like it that much 
Yeah. I'm really pissed at you. I'm gonna need to do a lot of editing. She's gonna do a lot of editing, guys, because I did not vlog so good today because I was all over the place. Like, literally forgot to vlog so many times because I was just so stressed out. There were so great. many people. That's amazing. I will see you guys later. Guys, we're about to cut the cake for Gunnar. Just celebrate because Gunnar's coming. Guys, we're about to cut the cake for Gunnar. Look over here. Um, party. Okay. Three, two, congratulations, Gunnar! Congratulations, Gunnar! Congratulations, Gunnar! Get in prices. That's it. That's it. Good. Good job. So the Nugi, like, how do you feel after the Nugi's winning? That's a good feeling. Yeah. Must be you. He likes that you're the best. He's the most charming. Dar mu dek Nugi jeet liu ke nahi jeet. Like that? Like that? Confident? Like that? 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 Arna, do you think the Nur would win? Yes, of course. Why would you think she would win? Because she's really confident and she's like really good at talking. Yeah. That's really good at that. She's gonna win, guys. Hey guys, we're having cake now. How do you feel? I feel so good. I'm so happy for you. Oh, thank you. Yeah, guys. Okay, cake time. Hey guys, so I got back home last night very late and now it is day two and now it is the fashion show. And I just want to say guys, I am literally on the urge of crying because I am so freaking tired. But that's totally okay because we just got to push through this day. Then I have a lot of days to rest and then I'll recharge and start again. But yeah, so I'm so excited for today though. Anyways, it is a super chic Toronto Fashion Week. There's gonna be a bunch of cool designs. And then after that, my sister's going to record my walks and all the other outfits. And then you guys will see all the, but I wish I could show you all the behind the scenes, but I just don't have my phone with me. So it's really hard to show. show. But anyways, I'm so excited to show you guys everything. It's gonna be so much fun and yeah, let's go. Hey guys, so we are currently in the bathroom because my mom and my sister are getting ready and they're taking too long. And we literally have to go because um my show starts at two, but I have to get ready before that. This is the outfit guys. I have to do my hair and makeup still and then my boss will not be happy if I'm not on time because I have also fittings. So let's just hope these people hurry up because they always say that they're gonna not take time to get ready, but they do. Anyways, I'll see you guys later. Bye. Hi guys, this is Ashmeen here. So I don't know the last time when Gunnar guys updated you guys on this vlog. I know last time we were at home and she was like telling you guys that we're coming here on the same location that we were here yesterday. Oh, the trash can behind me is not a nice angle. But anyways, okay. Yeah, so we're here. Um, I don't think I showed you guys. Gunnar is right now in, um, what's it called? Fittings. And she's getting her outfits fitted for the show that's gonna be happening at like 2.30. And right now the time is 11.51. So honestly, like when we reach this hotel, we like dropped Gunnar off. And then honestly, we have been like so tired because whole week we were like out and like doing stuff for the pageant and stuff and I had school and then it was just so tiring and yesterday was so like just exhausting me and mom were just running around with heels and dresses like it was a very exhausting and stressful day because obviously the pageant was really stressful so today we're all busted so we we're just honestly doing nothing so that's why I didn't like record because there's nothing to really show you guys My parents are just sleeping um So I had to end the clip there because someone walked into the washroom and it was kind of awkward and she's cleaning so I didn't want to like 
like look weird. But anyway, as I was saying, so my parents are just sleeping and I am in this is embarrassing. But I am just in sitting on the couch and trying not to be embarrassed. Um but anyways, yeah, so I'm just sitting here because I can't sleep in public places. My parents are sleeping fine, I don't know how. So I'm just trying to like kill time and I'm also really tired too, so like I don't know like I should sleep, what should I do? But I am so sorry guys, I don't know what to show you. Like you won't see me like rambling, here I am, but if you guys want to see my outfit, see what I'm wearing today we kept it really casual. Um I did not feel like getting dressed up because yesterday was just how walking up and down in these heels and dresses. But I'm wearing this brown top that I stole from my mom because I don't have clothes currently. I still have this top, so I have it in blue. And then I'm wearing these like prayer shoe pants which are black. They're from garage. This is also my mom but I just stole my mom's outfit today because why buy your clothes when you can steal your mom's, right? And then I just have curls from yesterday in my hair because I was too lazy to do my hair again. Makeup is pretty simple today. Yesterday was crazy, but today I just kept it very simple. And then I just have these golden jewelry that I kept. I've been wearing blue golden jewelry for these past two days, which I kind of like enjoy. And then I have this golden necklace and the golden rings. Oops. And yeah, other than that, I am just gonna figure something out and I'll come back when I have something interesting to do. You guys, if you're thinking why I'm laughing, I'm laughing because my mom just hit my dad because he's bullying her because her eyes were watery and she has mascara like smudged down her eyes and she's getting bullied for it. But anyway, I I was gonna show you guys that we are about to eat and we are waiting for Gunur because she didn't come out yet for her break. I'm gonna eat chicken nuggets that I got from McDonald's and then I also have a lemonade and we're just eating and chilling and waiting for Gunur to come out. And then the show is gonna probably start soon and we're gonna probably have some clips of that. I'm going to update you guys because I forgot to update. We didn't do anything though, so it's fine. You guys didn't miss anything. Nothing. Except for me sleeping and my mom hitting my dad.
you guys, so this all just ended and me and my mom are so tired. He was sleeping half of the vlog, mom tell them. I don't know if I had a makeup on my face, but I don't know if I had a problem. I had a clean face, I had a clean face. I was so tired, 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 I was so tired. Sometimes I didn't know if I was so tired, I was so tired, I was so tired. Today I was so tired, I was so tired. Some times I was so tired, I was so tired, I was so tired. I didn't know if I was so tired, I was so tired. Yeah, no, we were tired because Four yesterday it was very exhausting, nerve-wracking, emotionally, mentally, physically. And then today I had to wake up early and come here. So we are going to probably crash after this, but I'm probably going to give you an update when she comes out because I am tired. I don't think I'm going to give you any more updates. But this but is just... Instagram the yeah, I just wanted to update you guys that she's done and she'll be probably out. And we'll probably leave and then Gunnar has the camera. So yeah, I'm going to say that and... Yeah, hey guys, so I just came out my fashion show and it was so much fun as you guys can see all the outfits and now we're gonna go and get food I'm going to Chipotle because I'm so hungry guys. I couldn't eat anything I absolutely had no time and then after that we are going to go to Starbucks because I haven't had Starbucks in two days guys I've broken the record and I'm going to get a matcha because it is very well needed Do you want to say anything I should have was the show? It was good. I'm tired. So I'm running to get my story yes because it is a very big need but the show is really good and i'll see you guys in chipotle i guess okay hey guys so basically we are going to just go outside for a little bit because we did come home like pretty like in the afternoon because we just were so busted and tired that we are just going to chill last now. Mm -hmm. I'm going to play soccer outside and she's coming with me, obviously. Unfortunately, it's not my and choice. And basically, we are just going to end this video here. Yeah. If you guys did enjoy these, you know, two series of vlogs, thank you so much for all the support that I also got throughout this whole entire time of, you know, being in the Miss Canada Nation Universe pageant. I appreciate it so much. I couldn't have won or do any of this without your, you guys, especially my family and my friends and I have so much to say and I just don't even have words right now because I'm so so speechless that this happened mm -hmm. and I couldn't have done this without even my pageant coach support Miss US Nation company and so much more make sure you go follow my Instagram it's gonna be down link below and my thread because there's a lot of updates coming on there soon and now next up that our next pageant stop is Miss Nation Universe where I'm going to nationals in November so so much content is coming up very soon for these next months so make sure to subscribe to see my journey I love you guys all so much bye Bye. Bye.